Dun 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 Hello everyone! Thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwa and welcome to my YouTube channel. So today, we're going to talk about James Bond. It's been a couple years since I've talked about James Bond. We're going to take a look at my collection. and we'll give you my thoughts on Spectre, the new movie. And then uh, we'll just go from there, alright? I'll, I'll give you guys my thoughts on who the next James Bond should be and stuff like that. It'll be a fun video, okay? So there's a couple things missing. Uh, if you've watched my video games, uh, my, my videos from the past when I talk about James Bond, uh, you may notice some things are missing. I have been looking up and down my room for it, and I, I can't turn my room up, upside down any further. I don't know where they are, but there's a couple books that I have of James Bond. I don't know where they are, all right? So we just have to, <laughs> I'm gonna say screw it, let's just make this video, all right? Um, let's just go ahead and start. I only have one book that I can show you right now, and that's Cardi Blanche, it's kind of hard to hide it. Uh, I do have like a comic book, a uh, little graphic novel of James Bond, I don't know where it is, but, uh, but there it is. This is the only book I have. Uh, it's not original Ian Fleming stuff, but, uh, but it's, it's actually a good, good story, by the way. Uh, the movies, if you remember, my uncle went to Vietnam and he bought me all the movies. They didn't come with their original packaging, but at least I have the films, alright? So here I have, I printed off from the internet these boxes right here. They have all the movies right there. So, they all correspond. So there it is. Okay, I don't have the original packaging. He just got the disc only. Uh, these are official right here. So I got Skyfall, Quimxalas, Casino Royale, Diner Day. We got some, uh, like the Women of James Bond or whatever it's called. What is this called? Bond Girls Are Forever. <laughs> and then we got the James Bond story on DVD. We got that spoof movie, Casino Royale. Okay. Uh, over here we got video games. We got Bloodstone, Double Seven Legends, GoldenEye for Xbox 360, Chrome Solace. Agent Under Fire. I also have a uh, Diner Day, uh, not Diner Day. Uh, uh, World is Not Enough, and uh, Tomorrow Never Dies um, for PlayStation One, but they don't have boxes. Here's a little book I have: The Secret World of 007. It's up to date, up to uh, Quantum Solace at least, which is fine enough for me. We got some action figures back there. You've seen these before. I actually made like videos unboxing them and stuff like that. I just pop them back in the boxes. <laughs> and then here we have magazines. Let's put these away. This is the new one that we just got. Got this in the mail the other day. I'm a subscriber to Entertainment Weekly. If you guys like to subscribe too, it's like, you know, cheap. <laughs> Here's from the past. This is when Skyfall came out. This is during the 50th anniversary. Okay, so uh, my thoughts on Spectre? Well, <laughs> I haven't seen it yet, so I can't tell you much on that. Uh, there's been a lot of rumors that this is Daniel Craig's final movie. Um, <clears throat> I think four is good enough. You know, that's a good good number to end on. Uh, if it is this last movie, <laughs> let's wait till after Spectre becomes a huge hit and he starts getting paychecks and he really uh, let's ask him if he really wants to quit after getting that that uh, that money <laughs> and he becomes world famous and stuff like that. So anyway. Uh, the next James Bond? Uh, I gotta go, guys, but the next James Bond, probably uh, Adam Sandler. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.